I have two different types of favorite bike. One is my favorite bike to ride. The other is my favorite bike to own. Usually that's due to the build, the quality of the components, or the aesthetic. There's just something about it that makes me want to have it. And for me, that bike is the IKEA Slada. It's less something that I would want to ride every day, and more an item of adoration. It's not as much a bike as it is a work of art, and I'm not the only one that thinks that way. The IKEA Slada has won awards, and it definitely fits the bill of an award winner. It has smooth lines, a belt drive, and no external gearing. It's all internal in an internally geared rear hub. The Slada would also possibly be a contender for my favorite riding bike if that internally geared rear hub had more than two gears. And that hub has also been the source of many comments, both for and against, but recently one comment in particular stood out. Claimed that SRAM had left the internally geared hub market. A quick internet search verified this comment. SRAM has indeed stopped production. It even mentioned the automatics specifically. That's what the Slada uses. IKEA is known to buy in bulk, so I didn't think this would be an immediately impactful thing on the Slada. It only took a week before I started seeing more comments from people all over the world saying they could no longer find the Slada available on the IKEA website. I checked the IKEA US website, and sure enough, no Slada bike. There's a few Slada bike accessories and some Slada branded bike related components, but no Slada bike. That led me to contact IKEA US support, and they were surprised to confirm that it was no longer on their site, but that the bike was still in stock and available at every US IKEA. Less than a week later, I saw another viewer comment that their local IKEA had not only removed the Slada bike display, but also all inventory of the bike. Concerned, I contacted IKEA US again, and this time I spoke for over 20 minutes with a very helpful representative that found a stop sale notice in their system, and a further note that said it was due to a supply production issue. I think it's safe to point the finger at that SRAM hub and the production halt as being the reason for this. So what's all this mean for the Slada? I can still find Slada racks at IKEA, as well as see pictures of the Slada on the bike lock and backpack pages. When you get to the Slada utility cart, which was previously marketed as a direct add-on to the Slada bike, there's a noticeable void of any mention of the Slada itself. More concerning is that in the pictures of the cart, the picture with the cart connected directly to a Slada bike appears to have been removed. Instead, we get a picture of the cart being pulled by hand. Has the Slada's flame already been extinguished? It's only been around for a couple of years. Or is this just a temporary hiatus before it comes back even better than ever? I already pamper my Slada, and if you have one, you may want to take better care of it, because who knows when we're going to be able to get more parts or even get another Slada. As for mine, I've purchased most of those Slada accessories, so you'll be seeing it more in upcoming videos as I get to those. In IKEA, if you were listening, I would pay more money for a 7 or an 8 speed internally geared rear hub. So bring the Slada back with that, and this bike could easily become my daily driver. As for those people that want a Slada and can't get one, hopefully it'll come back soon. But now may be a good time to contact IKEA. Not only let them know that we want it back, but we want more gears. I hope this video was informative. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.